and jazz. As a matter of fact, this bitch has got internet connection, which means that if you're a digital nomad, this is your bitch right here, your destination. Join me. It's Taco Time, and we're in Cancun. Super windy today. This beach is uh, is for surfers. I don't think they can surf right now. It is extremely windy. There's a red flag, which means that you cannot swim. There is no sargassum though. Uh, last time I came here, there was a lot of sargassum, but not anymore. It gets cleaned up by itself. So, so it's it, it's been raining for the last uh, two days, but uh, hey, see the sun came out again. I was not able to swim yesterday because it was rainy and it was cloudy, but today this is uh, sun came out and it is looking beautiful. To be extremely honest, I'm not seeing the the everyday turquoise blue water. It kind it kind of looks different today, but uh, it'll 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 go back to normal. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, find something to eat. There's this uh, super store that I want to show you guys. take you guys down there but I wanted to show you this beach uh, first we're gonna go ahead and grab a taco or something and then we'll go swim somewhere else but not here this is uh, pretty dangerous I don't bring my kids to this beach but I wanted to show you guys uh, because for when it comes to pictures and videos and stuff from up here it looks beautiful but like I mentioned now uh, we don't have to catch blues today This uh, spot right here on this beach, there's these uh, Cancun letters, uh, uh, they're really colorful and pretty much uh, if you take a picture on those uh, 
Cancun letters. Well, as a background, you have this gorgeous view. There is always a big line though. If you want to take a picture here, well, you need to make a line. I suggest you to uh, come up here in the morning. There's not that many people in the morning, so that will save you some time. But uh, yeah, this is the view that you will have in one of these pictures. You, uh, some of you guys already have one. Uh, well, you need an updated one. This guy, this guy's a taxi driver. Uh, for instance, they take a, a day tour on a taxi. They'll take them to a few places out here for pictures and stuff. And this is one of them places. You might want to do that as well, because definitely you need one of these pictures. transportation you already know what this means a uh, air conditioning bus and we're gonna go on this side a little bit uh, I'm getting hungry already it's about 12 o'clock and I'm getting hungry access to persons on wheels so if you have a person coming with you uh, on wheels well guess what if they have access to this one here
Uh, so this is a blue flag beach and if you guys need a connection or something if you need to upload a, a video or document or whatever well this beach has got access to the internet it, uh, it's got wi-fi if you oh, if you're also a uh, digital nomad you can just bring your laptop out here if you need to send an email or whatever this is this is the spot right here uh, zona publica public hotspot Get it going. This is it, uh, Supermarket Selecto, Chedrawi. You can, like I mentioned, you can find just about anything from beer all the way to a swimming suit or whatever. But the, the most important part is uh, food. Just about anything you want to need. There's 30% off. Uh, three per two. You buy three. You buy. You take three and you pay two. Look at these hats. I like. I like one of these. But I already got my own, so I guess I like mine better. But any kind of drink, look, they have all kinds of beers. All prices. Cold beer. So this is the advantage of this superstore that you can just grab your cold beer and take it to the beach. If you need a refill, then there's another store at the beach. Um, so for lunch, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a soda. Yeah, I know it's bad, but hey, when it comes to eating, I need a soda. And anything you might need, there's hot sauce, this kind of This is just like a Walmart. But with the specialty that there's food out here, they cook it uh, and it is delicious and it's affordable. So the soap to buy to wash your clothes, uh, anything, anything you need. Like I mentioned, this is just like a Walmart, <clears throat> and it is right in the heart of Zona Hotelera pretty much uh, right here right across we have uh, Playa Caracol and we have Playa Forum out here and if you if you want to take the if you want to take public transportation they'll, they'll both routes they'll drop you off here it's called Chedrawi but when it comes to the food court uh, we need to go to the, uh, the second level You can find just about anything if you are if you like veggies if you're into uh, if you're into diet and stuff there you can you can buy your your produce here you can you can get your uh, you can get your salad um, if you like fancy you can buy your New York steak right there they'll cook it for you if you're trying to buy a ceviche or something they have ceviche they have cocktail um they have burgers they have pizza there's sushi there's just about anything um i'm gonna go ahead and show you if you like to get a nice tequila to take it back home well there's fancy fancy alcoholic fancy tequila all kinds of tequila out here with a 30 percent off look so 
Yeah, if you're trying to take some back home, boy, yeah. this is this is the place right here. If you if you like some more fancy than that, then uh, look, there's 30 percent off. The bottle is a thousand five hundred and fourteen. So that's 15 1500 pesos for that bottle this is 2000 pesos for that bottle 2120 for that out uh, wine but you get a 30 percent off yeah, but if you just want to taste it if you just want a little bit of it you, you know you can always grab some right here you don't have to pay for the for the whole bottle but um but that's it now I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys this entire area out here. But uh, let me let me find a nice place to put my backpack first. I'm trying to get a nice view over here in the back uh, with a nice lagoon view. And how about this one here? looky looky this is why i love this place first of all because of the prices but the view out here this is what i like to uh, have breakfast pretty much three times a week if you're on vacations this is this is your meeting point this is where you need to come up here early in the morning grab your food and either take it with you or have your breakfast out here decide where you want to go and go from here this point cordon blue chicken breast uh, this is a uh, mesquite mesquite chicken this is a uh, potato uh, fried chicken fried fish if you if you if you like salad if you enjoy uh, vegetables and stuff well look they got it for you you just pick you pick up what you want they'll wait it for you and that's it but um yeah if you like fancy things there's uh there's all kinds of food out here um we have a bakery i'll suggest you to try it we have parmigiano reggiano and i'll suggest you to i'll suggest you to try this bakery it is really good if you haven't tried mexican bakery you're missing a lot If you, if you feel like cooking during your vacation if you don't have uh, all inclusive you can always come and get your stuff out here there's always uh, look this there's 10 percent out here on uh, arrachera this is a really good meat really tasty guacamole is ready for you they have cecina and if you want to make it a little bit more fancy well there's a uh, shrimp and look at this Look at this. These are alive. Hello. Look that one in the back. That's it's moving its tail. Yeah, they're they're alive. Look at this. Fresh. And they have uh, salmon here. All right, so. Look, if you if you want to make something really quick to take it to the beach, you can just grab this, take guacamole and a little bit of shrimp, and you're all set. You you make a nice uh, ceviche, so you can take it to the beach. Or if you want to grab, I don't know, bread, mayonnaise, and and some of these uh, ham, you're all set. Look at this bread. 
That looks tasty, does it? Yeah. All right, well, I'm about to order what I'm gonna eat today. So I'm gonna go ahead and take two things today. I'm gonna go ahead and get a. Um, I was thinking on a ceviche, but I'm gonna go ahead and get a uh, cocktail, uh, shrimp and octopus. And I'm also going to get a breakfast um, to show you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and get a um, chicken, uh, chicken breast. It is the cordon bleu. Cordon bleu. It's really good. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Mamba number five. Ah, now for my brown brothers. Sorry, no tortilla. What do you mean, no tortillas? So, this is the most affordable breakfast out here in the hotel zone. If you want to compare the price out here at this Chidrawi, 68 pesos. If you go to a restaurant, you're going to be paying around 280 pesos for this meal. You're going to have to buy some stuff. Perfectly dry. So it comes with uh, beans and white rice. Really good. I gotta tell you, I love beans with uh, with this sauce and with this kind of bread. It's called bolillo. You should try a torta just with beans and this sauce. We got cheese and. Uh, I believe it's not ham, it's, it's more of a pork chop. And you gotta have that Tabasco sauce, you already know. So this is a, a 68 peso, 68 peso meal. Can't find better than this. Or if you like to get something a little bit fancier, well, you can always get, get a cocktail. This is shrimp and um, octopus for, it is 190, but there's 10% off right now, so it was around 170, which is still affordable because we're in the hotel zone. If you were to purchase this at, I don't know, senior products, that would be like 350 pesos. It does not have enough avocado, but hey, I'll, I'll go ahead and let it pass this time. I usually get an avocado 
to put it on my cocktail but this time I already had a little bit of breakfast so we're good And then, and then three minutes later, we get rain. So I was just about to go to the beach, but if you notice, there's sun out there, but not here. There's sun all the way out there, but not here. I was just ready to go swim, but I might, it might not happen today. Alcohol everywhere, you already know this is Mexico and there's margarita up and down. But if you but if you but if you're still looking for something fancier when it comes to alcohol for you to take to the States, I'm gonna go ahead and introduce you here. So, uh, okay, this is look. This is a 3,399 peso tequila, 1,800 millennial extra añejo. All right, this one is gone, but it was 2,949. This uh, tequila, this is Jose Cuervo Reserva de la Familia, uh, 3,499. So that's that's pricey. So after this meal, we're about we're about ready to go uh, swim. So I already paid for my stuff, and we're just ready to go. So. Uh, we're still going to uh, we're still going to the beach today. To be extremely honest, I need to grab some water for my fish. I do have a fish tank at home. And it's a little, it's a little, uh, it's a little cube, and uh, I need to take some uh, uh, clean water. So I'm forced to go to the beach today. Uh, I grab a six six gallon uh, bottle of water for my uh, for my nano tank. I'm a digital nomad, so I cannot have a big ass tank. I have a nice little 18 liter nano tank with a few, uh, uh, what is it called? Peces Payaso, clownfish. And, uh, but hey, this is, I wanted to show you guys, this is where it all starts. At night, this is a beautiful place. Lots of lights and everything. So yes, it is, it is, uh, this is the rainy season. But to be extremely honest with you, uh, for the time that I've been here, I noticed that. Hold on. Well, I noticed that it, it always get, it always rain after the afternoon. So if you're if you're around here in the uh, rainy season, try go swimming in the morning. If you notice, in the morning we went to Playa del Finis and it was not raining. People just don't care about the rain out here. I mean, I'm going to the beach, so I, why would I care? They're trying not to get wet. Wet. 
Alright, I see. Um, you guys already know this place, so I don't have to say much about it. Um, it's a nice day. Alright, and we are here. I can already smell the salty uh, water. Um, you know, this is this is one. Of, this is my favorite beach in the world. Yes, not only because of their beautiful blue colors, but also there's a, there's a store. There's a 7-Eleven right on the beach, and you know what that means? That means cold beer. That means uh, that means uh, fresh made food. Well, you know, chimichangas and stuff. Uh, there's drinks. If you have a flight later on today, but you already check out from your hotel, well, no worries. Look, there's a locker here where you can just put your clothes or your luggage. God damn, I don't think we're gonna be able to swim today. there's no way that we're gonna go ahead and swim out here but we're gonna continue walking towards our left side I'm sure we are going to be able to swim all the way up there but we gotta go that side so here we go So I found this guy's place out here, but it's still, uh, it's still wavy, but we have this nine little break right here where we can swing. It's not that dangerous. If you notice, there's a lot of difference between here and over there. So we're going to go ahead and uh, jump in into the water over there for you to see what's in the water.